This week, Sudanese directors and actors made their way to Egypt, harnessing the power of cinema to shed light on the devastating war, ravaging their homeland and the world's indifference to it. At the Aswan International Women Film Festival, Sudanese filmmakers showcased five short films highlighting the country's plight. This is the right time for us to speak out and raise our issues, even if it's a simple production, but it is an opportunity to shine a light on issues that are often ignored within the society. <coughs> in the wake of Bashir's ousting, Sudan initially saw a glimmer of hope in a civilian-led transition. However, this hope was dashed amid violent power struggles among rival generals. Now, Sudanese filmmakers and actors are determined to reignite that hope. The current conditions are difficult, but Sudanese film production is still the result of suffering and all previous productions, whether the film You Will Die at 20 or subsequent productions, were made under oppressive regimes. And now the repression has increased, and I don't expect the film industry to stop in Sudan, because there is interest from us and others. So let's hope this doesn't stop. In a Sudan yearning for change, a new wave of cinema has emerged, fueled by the energy of the revolution that ousted Bashir. The journey of Sudanese filmmakers and actors to Egypt this week signifies a powerful commitment to using cinema as a tool for awareness. This emerging wave of cinema serves as a beacon of resilience and a testament to the enduring spirit of the Sudanese people.